Welcome back to my show. Let's find out how the guests did and how I did tonight. Let's go to tonight's op-ed. National Review reporter Catherine Timpf, who needs a vowel. She's been watching the show all night, I hope. And now she'll assess exactly how many things I got right and how many things everyone else got wrong. Isn't that right, KT? No. Uh, first of all, I've been going through all your math and all of the Hillary is evil stuff. Right. Uh, and it turns out that it's uh, not math. <laughs> well, then what is it? It was numbers. Well, also you said that Kiss went out into public without makeup for the first time in 1936. Uh, not true. They weren't alive. What? Uh, I said it was, it was 1986. Also, when is going to be the first time that you go out into public without makeup on? <laughs> you know what? You're changing the subject. You were wrong. I said 1986. No, you didn't. I, I, I did. I'm ombudsing you. No, you're not. All right. We'll move on. You made a mistake. All right, I, I don't make mistakes. Um, Joanne, if you wanted people to not know the answers, you should have asked harder questions. I thought they were hard. Um, no, if, I mean, no? the only easier questions would have been if you asked about women's basketball trivia, you know? That'd be oh. the only easier thing I can think of. You pick, like, the second easiest thing. You're right. <laughs> yeah. yeah, you're right. Um, Tucker, uh, you said you laughed, you cried, you experienced the full emotional range. Yes, for the first time. Uh, that is not the full emotional range. Um, well, there was stuff in between. No, there's those also poles. the laugh so hard you cry, the cry so hard you laugh. Right. Uh, the, you know, the being not mad, just disappointed, the being disappointed, just right. mad. And, you know, those are just the ones I've had today. And envy, so. guilt, and shame. No, no, it was yeah, all, all of it lot. was in there, for sure. That was all, implied. Yes. Um, Greg, you got a lot wrong on the pothead stuff. Well, explain to me what I got wrong. I'd love to hear it. Well, you are not really considering all the ways that potheads are contributing to the economy. Uh, well, why don't you um, give me some examples? Uh, snacks, Bob Marley posters, infinity tattoos, Visine. Uh, Urban Outfitters would go out of business completely. Mm -hmm, that's uh, true. That's and true. the fast food industry. What about the fast food industry? Yes, but you know what? There's a lot of non-potheads that use the fast food industry, too. I, I, I don't know about that. Also, uh, <laughs> you saying that it's detrimental and makes people sit on the couch. Mm -hmm. um, it looks like liberal Internet's not too happy with that. Uh, I'm seeing some headlines. Uh, Fox News host, drugs are the reason all poor people are poor. <laughs> oh, yes. So that's going to be a little rough. You might, I don't know. <laughs> so, yeah, um, but then seriously, go out into public without makeup. I, I do all the time. Well, I actually I, look better I without makeup. I understand. The last time I did it, some kid looked at his dad and asked him if I had Ebola. <laughs> and so that was a little tough. But you got to do tough things sometimes. Yeah. So how did this first show so far go? At comparing it to other firsts, like the first Star Wars or the Old Testament. Um, I've never <laughs> seen Star Wars. I've never read the Old Testament. Oh, wow. All right. Well, that's a, you've just. So you're the best. Uh, Thanks. Thanks, Joanne. Minus. What? B minus. B minus? Okay. Well, that's all right with me. All right, Catherine, Joanne, and Tucker, uh, thank you for being on this very first show. But it's not over because for you at home, I have something to say after the break. But first, let's go to our live traffic cam outside the studio. It's really a madhouse. A lot of people trying to get in to see the show tonight. They couldn't make it. Uh, but it's a great sign for us. The buzz about the show is really building. Uh, Joanne, as you noticed, they got rid of the traffic lights uh, yeah. to see if it would flow even better. And clearly, it does make things smoother.